We're starting off red hot here on NWA USA. You know, this was originally scheduled to be a tag team match. Jax Dane was supposed to be tagging with Magic Jake Dumas, but he's no-showed this matchup. But it's still happening, it's still going, and now it's a handicap match for Magic Jake. Now Magic Jake's gonna need to find some magic to beat these two guys. Ooh, that big hip toss. Japanese arm drag. Yeah. And he held on to it. I'm liking this offense. Yep, locking, locking that wrist, winding it up a little bit. Putting pressure on that elbow, that shoulder. What is CJ doing? She's, she's smiling as she's her, her man is, is, is getting his butt kicked. Is, yeah. What is she doing? I don't know, but also you can see the other manager for Thrill Billy Silas on the outside, Poyo Del Mar. I, Joe, I have to point this out. Every week, Poyo is looking more and more. Country yeah. Since aligning herself. Well, I, I think that they really just kind of, they instantly fell in love. Love at first sight. I mean, that's what the Thrill Belly says. Thrill Belly says, Poyo Damar is the most beautiful woman walking the earth. Tag is made, in comes Brett. Yeah, it looks almost like right a magic What do you think it here? It's Look at the power. Like Look at the strength of the Thrill Belly. Oh, he ducked. He ducked it. And magic check. The tag was made. He's got to kick him out. Claude at the face. Going using the ropes. Choking him on the ropes. Oh, look, see, now CJ got, got it. Now, now CJ's got it. How do you like that, little Billy? Huh? I'm super impressed with the strength of the thrill, Billy. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Rough shade. It's like a weapon. A lot of magic Jake to overcome in a handicap match, but right now. He's got him in the corner, he's isolated him, he is wearing him out with those knees. And still the question is, where's our NWA national champion? Why is he a no-show on this show, this NWA USA, where we feature that championship? Slam. Beautiful slam there. Can he get into the cover? Oh, oh that is not cover. Way too confident, way too confident, especially in a handicap match. You gotta try to win this thing, or just choke somebody out. Four. Oh my get, yeah, you can get disqualified. Thrill right Billy's not all into the, the dark head, magic. Uh, apparently. It's a oh. Oh. Meeting the knee. Oh. 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 How's that for a trip? Thrill Billy. How about hands up? How's that for you? You'll learn to read and you'll learn to write. Oh, it took a little too long. Got distracted. It's going to be Shoulders down. Two count. Come on, Joe. Got it. Come on. Magic Jake trying to set up the suplex. Got him. Oh, wow. Look at the power of Magic Jake. Look at the strength. From Magic Jake Dumas. Come on, boy! And yeah. still jaw jacking with the thrill belt. You ready to go home? He needs, he's, uh, he's in there by himself. He needs to focus on his opponent, make sure that the thrill belly doesn't get back in there, and he needs to take advantage of what he's doing right now. Up onto the shoulders, trying to get in the torture rack position. The quad daddy escapes. Magic the tag. Jake oh, goes in the corner. Oh, he was going for the hat. He was going for the hat. Oh, he gets completely level. CJ took the hat. Right when Magic Jake was reaching for it. Scoops him up, slams him down hard. Cover now. A kick out by Magic uh, Jake. Uh, now Thrill Billy, I mean, he is just so fresh. Uh, CJ, CJ needed that. Think Magic Jake would be too impressed with CJ wearing no. his hat. No, she needed that. I mean, she, she, does, she, does she does wear it better. She does wear it better. Yes. Short arm close line. Oh, no. Oh, here Boy, we go. Here's CJ. Uh oh. Poyo Damar thinks CJ is hitting on the thrill belly. She's really She's trying to take the thrill belly with the hat. She's really not, though. She might be. She, CJ is not faced by any goal. Brett Buff Shea now. He's in the ring. The referee. He's trying to get some control. What is going on? Where, where are they going? What is happening? What's happening? See, did CJ make him disappear? That rising quad into the body. And now the referee's trying to figure out what's going on. Well, we're down to a singles match now. And now apparently. CJ, she's up on the apron. We're really losing control at the beginning of this episode here. A lot of damage has been done to Magic Jake. Can he get it done? He hit it. He hit it. Cadaver. Cover, cover. Magic Jake gets it. The winner of this match, Magic Jake Dumas.
Yes. Where did the thrill bully go? Where did Poyo? They just went under the ring. Are they making out under the ring? What is happening right now? Did they just go under the ring? For some privacy? So many I, questions, you know, so you know what? If they did, thank goodness. Oh, and now look at what's happening. No, not the card. Oh, that was again. No. Don't, don't cut no, his eyes. Open no, no, the queen of hearts. No, I can't. Oh, my God, into the eyes. Into the eyes. It's like swiping a credit card through a machine. Oh, my gosh. Only that machine that, is that. That can tear your retinas. Oh. That can leave a person with, with permanent vision loss. What a way to start things off here on NWA USA. Big, big victory, but at the same time, I'm still wondering what in the world happened with the Thrill Bully punch. Why would you stop right there? Uh, they Why go? wouldn't you just wait till the match is over? Where did they go? You know, I guess sometimes <laughs> when it's time, it's time. I don't know. I mean, I don't. I, the, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, wait, there, there they, they are. are. Oh, he wow, did that, come out wearing her hat. What the heck were they doing uh, under there? Good for them. Uh, it looks like Poyo's shirt is untucked uh, now. Okay, well, anyways, anyways. You know what? Oh, please, you know what? None of my business. <laughs> I want a card across my eye. Ladies and gentlemen, something. it's Joe Galley, Tim Storm, and it's time. It's time. It's velvet time, baby. Oh, and we have yeah. a very jam-packed <laughs> episode of NWA USA, so let's go through what you're going to be seeing here. PJ Hawks is taking on Homicide for the Junior Heavyweight Peace. Championship. We also have Jamie Stanley taking on Casey Rocks. And Casey Rocks, he is now under that learning tree right. of Aaron Stevens. We're going to see how much wrestling he's going to learn, because this is the NWA wrestling as it's meant to be. Presentation and Chris Silvio Esquire. I see you're trying to push me out of here. This is my podium, sir. And speaking of your uh, Jack Stane, the, the national champion here, I, he didn't even show up for the match tonight. Can you explain that? I mean, sure, Magic Jake won, but it was looking dicey for a while. Objection, Kyle Davis. Speculation, man. Jack Stane didn't no show. The Dane event didn't come because the Dane event did not have to show up tonight. Dearest friend Kyle. And do you know why that is? I have no idea. He was booked for a match. He was here. Of course you don't, Kyle. Give me my podium for a moment. The Dane event has fulfilled his contractual obligations. He required at minimum two fortnights before appearing on any NWA television broadcast. He got one fortnight. He's not coming. Sorry, guys. No from Jack's Dane. Tonight... The Dane event is canceled. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Guys, I didn't want to. I'm Hold on one second here. Uh, uh, Mercurio, one of the newest faces of the NWA, seems to have some sort of issue that he needs to address with us. Mercurio. I know, I know exactly why this guy's out here, and I'll tell everyone. I did some digging on this young man over here. Silvio is an Italian last name. I heard we have a new Italian wrestler. I did my research and it turns out that this man right here is fraudulent. He is not who he says he is. He's here on an expired visa. Tell him. No, no. You got it all wrong, Silvio. I know you use a visa. I use a MasterCard. Not that kind of visa. I don't know what you're talking about, and, and a second of all, I'm gonna offend offended because you have a name like a Silvio, it's an Italiano, yes. and you know how to not say my name. My name is Morchiario. You have to show some respect, and you say it with the right differenza. My name is Esquire. Can you say that? I gotta tell you something. I don't like the way you're talking to me, 
and you started making me make an ugly face. And a nobody makes me make an ugly face. You understand that? Okay, okay. Let's, let's cool off, Kyle. Do your thing from here. You didn't make an ugly face. We gotta go to break. National Wrestling Alliance and Fight brings you the ultimate streaming service for everything NWA. This is NWA All Access. For just $49.99 a year, you'll get every single NWA pay-per-view, NWA Power days before the rest of the world, NWA USA, and special fight exclusive content. All the pay-per-views, all the action, all the power. For only $49.99 a year, that's a savings of over $100 versus just ordering everything alone. To subscribe, visit fight.tv today. That's F-I-T-E dot TV. Join the thousands of fans that have already subscribed to the toughest brand in professional wrestling. The NWA, wrestling as it's meant to be. Experience the National Wrestling Alliance live. Join us for three action-packed days of NWA Power and NWA USA tapings, Monday, August 29th, Tuesday, August 30th, and Wednesday, August 31st, as the NWA returns to Skyway Studios in Nashville, Tennessee. Scheduled to appear, NWA World's Heavyweight Champion Trevor Murdoch, Nick Aldis, NWA World Women's Champion Camille, NWA TV Champion Tyrus, Matt Cardona, Tom Latimer, and many more. Tickets on sale now at nwatix.com. That's nwatix.com. The NWA, wrestling as it's meant to be. Flying. Oh, oh, the yeah. Yeah. Wow, Tyrus is in trouble. You don't really see him him in this position often. Oh, 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 I stand corrected. Oh, he's sizing him up. He's sizing him up for that oh, heart punch. He hits this. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, he hits it. The heart punch, the heart punch. Wow. The winner of this match, and still NWA World Television Champion, Tyrus. Tyrus with an impressive victory, holding on to that World Television Championship. is one fall with a 10 minute time limit. Introducing first, from Detroit, Michigan, it's that dude, Jamie Stanley. America's John Line making his way to the ring here on NWA USA. He's feeling real confident going into this matchup too. He knows he has a huge size advantage. I think that's gonna play a major part in his offense. Nashville. And hailing from Let's Daytona Beach, business. Florida. Accompanied by Aaron Stevens, this is the Dojo Cat, KC Rocks. Yeah, KC Rocks. We've seen this young man challenge Tyrus in the Slam Challenge not That's too long ago. But he has been training hard. That's why they're calling him the, the Dojo Cat. Uh, but what another strange... Uh, relationship, another strange pairing. I, I don't get this I, at all. I had an opportunity to talk to Aaron Stevens. And he said that this is all about mentorship. He wants to give back. He wants to give back to the people in the wrestling industry. He knows he's no longer going to be a competitor. That's why, you know, he's good friends with Rodney Mack. He's not really trying to give him any mentorship, but he is working as his manager. But for this young man here, for Casey Rocks, he's really trying to teach him the ropes, but Casey Rocks. Is he mentoring oh. him, them in the back? Because they're ringside. See how he's distracted? He's on no, his phone No, yeah, he's right taking now. a call oh, right wait now. A what kind of that's, mentoring that's exactly is that? Right. I don't know what's going on. Even when we've seen Aaron Stevens out here with Rodney Mack, it doesn't yeah. seem like he pays much attention to what's going on in the ring. It seems like he's Aaron Stevens is in his own little world. And as we see right now, it's the same thing. He's not mentoring. Yeah. He's not doing anything. He's not even paying attention. He's well, it makes me wonder. Maybe he's trying to... He's on his phone. Maybe he's talking to the airlines, trying to figure out what happened to that flight that he was supposed to take but with look, May Valentine he's not to Brazil. This. Yeah, but this is there's a time and a place for that, Joe. Yeah, it certainly isn't now. Maybe he was checking with the dojo to, to see what kind of strategy he could get out of his butt kicking in this guy's taking right now. This crowd's coming alive for Casey Rocks. Strikes to the face, gets some separation. Ducks the back elbow, oh, what a power slam! This could be over here. Oh, come on. 
Jamie Stanley could have had it won there, picking up Casey Rocks. Well, I, I, I hear Aaron Stevens kind of, there he goes. He's saying, don't give up, stay strong. Oh, look at this. Casey Rocks, oh, close through. Inside cradle, he got him down with a one count. Looking for a crucifix, and he gets it. Shoulders are down. Oh, oh, now, now Aaron yeah, Stevens is Steven excited excited now. He's getting real fired up. Schoolboy, oh, two count. Drop toe hold. Oh, oh, Aaron Stevens. My Aaron gosh. Stevens. Getting involved. What an upset. Aaron Stevens the winner of this match, KC Rocks. One's got to wonder, was that always part of the plan, or was Aaron Stevens just kind of reacting in the moment? If that was part of the plan, that, if that's part of the plan, that's genius. I mean, I look. Right, this has got to be the first down. victory, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely it is, and a big victory here on NWI right. USA. we got to take a quick break. When we come back, our main event, PJ Hawks takes on Homicide. Please welcome Mike Knox, VSK, and Brian Myers. Now, Mike, you are going to be facing Bully Ray at NWA 74. What do you think your chances of winning are? What? what? Who sent that in? What a disrespectful question. What? Listen, listen, hey, listen. I don't think you should be asking Knox what his chances are. Uh, Bully Ray, what do you think your chances are? Let's be real. Uh, Mike, <laughs> would you like to say something? Ah, uh, Bully. My chances seem very, very well. I'm no longer under your boot. I'm no longer under your control. You have absolutely no idea what I plan to do to you. No idea, brother. Okay. We'll see what happens at NWA 74. Thanks for that great Thank question. you, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Wrestling at the Chase is back August 27th and 28th as the NWA returns to the historic Chase Park Plaza Hotel in St. Louis, Missouri for NWA 74. Two nights of incredible action featuring title defenses from all the NWA champions. Plus, NWA wrestling legends will be in the Coruscant Ballroom for NWA's 74th anniversary extravaganza. Scheduled to appear, Baby Now, JJ Dillon, Barry Windham, and on Monday, August 29th at Skyway Studios, a very special appearance by Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Tickets are moving fast, so get yours now at nwatix.com. That's nwatix.com. The NWA, wrestling as it's meant to be. For over 70 years, one name has stood for history, legacy, and tradition in professional wrestling. And the centerpiece of that legacy is the original lineal heavyweight championship of the world. The one that started them all, known to many as the 10 pounds of gold. Now, by popular demand, you can own your very own symbol of excellence. As the NWA has teamed up with Fandu Belts to bring you the official replica of the NWA World's Heavyweight Championship. This meticulously handcrafted belt is available in two options, the original pre-2021 glory, as well as the revised 2021 version with the UK plate updated by yours truly. Own the granddaddy of them all, the 10 pounds of gold. To order, visit fandubelts.com slash NWA. Please welcome Ricky Morton. Ricky, I really want to understand why you decided to face Wrecking Ball Ligurski on NWA Power. Well, thank you, and everybody else does too, because sometimes they might think that I'm a little senile, I done lost my mind, I done got crazy, but I grew up in the NWA, and I know the best wrestlers in the world are here at NWA. Besides that, he's been telling everybody how old I am about my mullet, he's gonna jerk it off my head. But you see, I understand one thing, Wrecking Ball, I'm been through that, I've done that before. If you think that I'm scared of you, I'm not. And I'm stepping in that ring to wrestle you, to prove a point, not only to myself, but everybody else here at NWA. I'm ready for you. Come on and get you some. And Ricky, I think that you still got it. So wow. I wish you the best of luck. Thank you very much. The following match is one fall with a 20 minute time limit. And it's for the NWA Junior Heavyweight Championship. 
Introducing first from New Orleans, Louisiana, he is one half of Hawks RE. This is PJ Hawks. Big rematch from Always Ready. PJ Hawks with another shot at the Junior Heavyweight Championship. And from Brooklyn, New York, he is the NWA Junior Heavyweight Champion. He is the notorious legend, Homicide. Homicide, I mean, he has just been on a war path every single match that he's having. He's putting that title on the line. He's had quite a few title defenses Oh, yes, lately. he has, including against PJ. But PJ, in a losing effort, maybe he learned a few things that he might be able to bring into this match hip here, and he could make history right here on NWA USA. I guess we will find out. Well, Homicide has, has said, I am a fighting champion. I'll face any kind. And it's just a situation where he's not going to back down from anybody. Homicide's made it very clear he wants to have Kerry Morton challenge for that championship. So Kerry Morton's going to be facing the winner of this match at NWA 74. Oh, 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 oh. That wrist tied up. PJ spins out. There we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, picking the ankle. Oh, and wrapping it up. Oh, look at him. Yeah. I Oh, look at that grapevine in the legs. I think people, you know, they look at Homicide, they see a total street fighter, they see a guy who's always willing to poke somebody in the eye, punch him in the jaw, but he is such a He's a great technical yeah. wrestler well, yeah. as and, well. And he is willing to do those things. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But he, he can also get down, the, yeah, he can get down on the mat and go with anybody. Homicide can pretty much do any style. You don't become a notorious legend without being able to, to, to wrestle or right. fight any way you need to. I mean, he's, you name it, he's done it. <laughs> Back at PJ into the ropes. Big back elbow. Scoop and a slam from the champion into the cover lateral press. One count. I'm ready with a B for PJ Hawks to be able to turn things around, become victorious in this match, and, and head into NWA 74 as a champion. Look at those legs, grab, grabbing the ankle with the other, and he's, he's PJ Hawks looking for a way out. Homicide's just hanging on. And you know, the reason why we're having this rematch is Homicide goes into the cover. It's because Homicide says PJ is better than Luke. And you know Luke, he has been absolutely red hot since our last pay-per-view, Always Ready. With, you know, from Luke's perspective, I mean, PJ Hawks was being destroyed by the fixers. Homicide was right there and didn't elect to go in and try to make a save and try to help us get it all. I mean, that's, that's, I, that's, mm, man, that's a tough, is he better than his dad? I, it, they're different without a doubt. Oh, yeah. You know, I mean, their, their styles are, are almost completely different. I think they're both excellent Absolutely. Right there's no doubt. Into the cover after the belly to belly. Just a one count. And Homicide actually out onto the apron. PJ Hawks trying to take advantage of that. Draping the feet. Oh! Lands him hard. Big neck breaker. Will it be enough? Two count. Entire weight pivoted on that neck. That's, that's not just pressure on the neck. That's power by PJ Hawks. I, I've never seen that before. Not like that. Isolating the arm of Homicide. Homicide! But at the end of the day, I mean, Luke Hawks, if, if PJ can pull it off, how proud would he be of his boy? Oh, Floats into the cover, one count. Got that arm tied up again. Right back to that arm. He goes. I got this. That's good strategy. I mean, you want to pick one thing and just completely wear it down. Break it down, absolutely. The strategy that PJ Hawks shows us, shows us every week is fundamentally sound. And a lot of that goes, the credit of that goes to his dad. I mean, they, they've worked out together, they've trained together, they fought Looking together. Looking for a cover there with a bridge! Two count. Homicide able to counter, crucifix pin. One count on PJ. Kick to the midsection, stops all of his momentum. Oh, there's one. Here we go. Number two. There's two. We're gonna see it. He's in fuego, feeling that Latino heat here in the NWA arena. Changing things up. Oh, he did. Picks the leg. 
Can Come he on, turn, turn him? Oh, around. Looking for that full Boston crab. Oh, PJ will be in trouble. Homicide can turn it, lock it in completely. He's so finding it. He's he finding it. Oh, wow. Those powerful legs of PJ. Able to counter. Runs into the back elbow. PJ up on the top, uh -oh. top turn buff. We've seen this before. Looking for that. Oh, he caught it. He caught it. Oh, right, to the, right to the quad. Yeah. He caught it. Oh. One, eight, seven, oh. Oh. Just slamming all of PJ's weight onto that knee. Oh, he's stacking up. Oh, now into the camel clutch. Ooh, Tucks the, the head. Neck. That was a deep cover. That was hard to kick Ooh. out of. PJ stepping over, fireman's carry. Single leg. Yeah. Oh. Homicide. Oh, but PJ rolls through. Grabs the leg on the way. Can he get the Hawks clutch? He's looking for the Hawks clutch. He's won a ton of matches with this. Uh-oh. He's got to get it in deeper. He's trying to hook that elbow through those ankles. Trying to do it. If he can get not close to any rope to break this submission. Oh, Homicide, he's in the air. Champion. He's crawl with all his might, get to the ropes. The damage is setting in, though. Oh, uh, homicide. Every second he can't goes reach by. it. He can't reach it. He can't reach it. Every second that goes by, the damage is, is setting in more and more. Even if he does get to the rope, the damage is done to those legs. Oh, boy. You can see the agony in the face of Homicide. That was th that was 30 or 40 seconds of all that pressure, and, and PJ Hawks, I don't think he ever got that completely hooked. He never got it deep enough, and Homicide had enough that he was able to fight to the ropes. And in most cases, you don't get, get to, yeah, you don't you don't get to see him do that. Homicide getting some separation, getting some space, but look at PJ leaving a punch, punch right in the throat. Finish him off, Homicide. Finish him off. Homicide. He is seeing stars after that DDT. Neckbreaker by Homicide. Yeah, homicide going Goes after the head and neck. Going after that neck. This could be it here. Two count. I'll tell you what cost, uh, uh, what cost Homicide right there. He reached up. He grabbed the off leg exactly like he's supposed to do. And his hand slipped. It gave just that second of hesitation. The type of action you can expect to see at NWA 74. Order the pay-per-view now. Look at that. Let's go! PJ trying everything he can. The veteran homicide. Oh, is he setting him up? Oh, he caught the kill up. Oh, can he do it? He did too much damage. Too much damage to the legs. PJ. He blocked it. He blocked that kick. Looks like single he's trying, trying to get that single, single leg, leg crab. Leg. That single leg crab. Transitioning. Into an STF. Yeah, the STF is locked in. He's got it locked in. He just can't see. He 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 can't PJ Hawks can't believe it either. What a championship bout this has proven to be. He's getting frustrated by the second here. PJ, oh! Nobody home. Oh, oh it's all tied up. up. Yeah, that leg's all up tied there. up in that. Oh, oh my God, I think, I think that was a little bit below the belt. That was a little bit below the belt. World Junior Heavyweight Champion, Homicide! I think Homicide actually got a little dirty there towards the end. <laughs> hey, we said it, we said it at the beginning. You do, he's done, historically, he's done what he has to do to get to, get to that victory. Congratulations, Homicide. He's going into NWA 74 as the champ. We'll see you this Tuesday for Power.